Did you know that you can record video and take screenshot of your game without spending a penny? Let's find out how. You have been working really hard on your game and now it's time to create some marketing material and post video and pictures on social media. Many developers struggle to produce high quality content to promote their game. Today you will learn how to record your screen for free using the recording package directly in Unity. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and visit my website to get ready game and publish it on mobile store. To record your screen, we first of all need to import the recording package, go to the window and then package manager. In the package manager, make sure you select the Unity registry and then in the search box, uh, just start typing recording. So select the recorder and let's install the package. Once the package is imported, you can close this window, clear out all of the messages. And now let's go to the window, general, recorder, and let's open the recorder window. I will dock it here. As you can see, we have some options to select here. So if you highlight on any of the option, you will see some explanation what this is doing. So you can set your, uh, your preferences. So once you're ready here, let's hit Add Recorder. And now I'm gonna first of all make some uh, images. So image sequence can set uh, the, uh, the settings for the image. So we can, on the source, we can record the game view. We can record the camera. So you can select the camera, which one you want to record. Uh, you can select the 360 view, render texture, and then texture sampling. I think most of, uh, most of the time you will uh, select either game view or the target camera, if you have specific camera for just for the screenshots. Uh, I'm going to select the game view, and then you can uh, select output resolution according to your needs. I'm going to just leave it as it is for now. Then media format. So this is uh, basically the type of the of the screenshot you wanna you wanna take. Uh, then we we can specify the file name. So as you see, by default you have some image, and then you have some uh, some addition to here. So the take is basically the, the take number. So every time you hit the record or make a screenshot, this number will increase automatically. So the name will be appended with that and then the frame. So this is the frame number. You can add uh, the wheel cards over here, whatever you need. Maybe you prefer the date instead of the take or the project name is up to you. So once you're ready here, uh, you can uh, start recording. All of your images will be, uh, will be stored in this location. You can hit this small button to basically open the browser. So as you see, this is the basically where it's going to record it. So it, it's going to be inside your project and under the recordings. Okay, so if I press play now, I can hit start recording. And then stop recording. And because I set the recording mode to manual, so it was keep outputting the frames as a JPEG until I press stop. So let's actually delete all of it. And now if you want to take just single screenshot, you have to select the record mode to single frame and then target frame will be zero. So we're going to just uh, select the first frame. So now if I hit the re uh, start recording, I, just, I have just taken one screenshot of my game and this is how it is. We can also make movie. So let's now do that. So I've just removed this uh, recorder, right click delete. I will add another recorder movie. I will leave the source the, for the game view. Uh, output resolution is going to match the window size. Uh, and then, of course, you you can select the media format. Uh, if you select the ProRes, for example, if you are on Mac, you will have some uh, Apple 
resolutions, but I will stay with the H.264 because this is the, sub, uh, the, the video format supported by YouTube and this is the MP4. Uh, the quality will be high and the name for the project is going to stay as it is and then take number will be one. Uh, there is one more thing, uh, the record mode, we need to change the single mode, uh, single frame to manual. Because if you will stay with the single frame, you will just essentially uh, record just the first frame. So select the manual and now when I uh, hit start recording uh, and I can pre play game. So I will just put something, something in. Okay, we should have some completed line. If I hit stop recording now, I have just essentially created the movie. So this is the movie I have just created. If I open the movie, you can see it's basically um, capture all of the all of the gameplay. And there is no lags, uh, 30 frames per second. So this video looks good. And uh, if you select the right resolution. You can upload it to your social media, um, to the Play Store, uh, Apple Store, or wherever you publish your game. So this is the very easy way to capture your game images.